Kim in Copenhagen writes to me, I just bought a new DAC. Well, congratulations, Kim. And before I bought it, I did a bit of research on the different prospects. And the one I bought was recommended to change the power supply to one of better quality. But what does that mean? It isn't a 12 volt power supply with, for instance, half an amp just a 12 volt power supply with half an amp? <laughs> You're obviously not talking to audiophiles here, buddy. <laughs> Isn't it important to follow the manufacturer's guidelines? So if they say it needs a power supply of 12 volts with half an amp, shouldn't I give it 12 volt power supply? Uh, I shouldn't give it a 12 volt power supply of 1.5 amps. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. Okay, couple of things here. First off, having more amps is fine. You could have a thousand amps. And as long as you hit the 12 volts, you're in good shape. And the reason for that is pretty simple. The DAC that you bought will only consume what it needs. It won't take more. In other words, you're not shoving something into the DAC. If you have a giant power supply, it will only take what it needs. I'll give you a good example. Your home. You plug your coffee maker. You plug your iPhone charging supply into the AC outlet. That AC outlet is probably capable of a couple of thousand watts. And yet your iPhone charger is only going to take one or two watts. Your coffee maker, the same thing. So it, anything you plug into a bigger supply is just fine as long as the voltage is the same. Do make sure the voltage is the same. Second part of that question, why would I want to change it? Well, power supplies are extremely important to good sonics. So this DAC you bought clearly has some kind of outboard power supply. And the better that supply, better caps, better regulators, et cetera, et cetera, the better your DAC is likely to sound. So I, I trust that answers your question. And thanks for asking it. Good luck out there. All right.